Yo, what's going on ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today we are once again back on Modern Warfare and I wanted to share with you guys the best class setup for the new Striker 45 Undertaker Blueprint. Uh, this is the final blueprint unlocked in the Battle Pass and a pretty interesting one at that. Uh, if you guys take a look at the attachments that come with this specific blueprint, uh, you'll see that we're all accuracy. We get a really massive accuracy boost. However, we end up losing a little bit of mobility and control, which we can obviously make up for. It also doesn't really make a lot of sense to boost the accuracy that much considering this gun is already extremely accurate so obviously we're gonna be able to make this thing better now if you guys take a look at the stats for the class setup that I'm gonna share with you in this video you'll see that we get a really nice accuracy and range boost we also really get a nice mobility and control boost nothing is in the red uh, most of our stats are in the green and overall it's just a really really good class setup so if you guys take a look at the attachments that we're gonna be using or not using a muzzle the barrel that we're using is the 400 millimeter stainless steel. With this, we're getting a boosted damage range, bullet velocity, and recoil control. Obviously, accuracy, range of control. Uh, we lose a little bit of mobility here, which obviously gets made up for with some of the other attachments later on. But again, the 400 millimeter stainless steel barrel. The laser that we're running is the 5MW laser. Now this is used for hip fire accuracy mainly. What's also nice is we get sprint to fire speed. Now because it's an SMG, we're gonna be playing really aggressive with this thing. So when we're running around corners, running through doorways, having sprint to fire speed is gonna be very, very clutch and help us out significantly. Also hip fire accuracy is gonna help us out a lot too because a lot of those gunfights that we get in are gonna be close quarters. So we'll be able to shoot from the hip and be able to get a lot more kills that way. We're not gonna be using an optic I don't think we need one with this class setup. Uh, I don't think most people use an optic with this gun. So uh, all we're really going to do is sacrifice aim down sight speed. So might as well not run one at all. The stock that we're using is the XRK Gen 3 Survivalist Series. So this is going to give us aim down sight speed. Essentially, we're just getting a small boost in mobility here. Uh, we lose a very, very tiny amount of control and accuracy, which obviously gets made up for. Uh, but having an aim down sight speed, again, for another attachment is really clutch, especially with an SMG. So again, the XRK Gen 3. Uh, the underbarrel that we're rocking is the Commando Foregrip, so we're getting recoil stabilization and aiming stability, giving us another boost to accuracy, range, and control here. The mobility drops a little bit, which is made up for with the other attachments, obviously, but another really good attachment to really help us out with accuracy and range. Last but not least, the rear grip that we're running is the FTAC G5XO, which essentially uh, is code name for stippled grip tape here for this weapon. Uh, like most of my videos, I say stippled grip tape is probably the most important attachment with every gun, uh, just because we get more sprint to fire speed and aim down sight speed. It's a really good way to boost your mobility, and uh, overall just a fantastic attachment to have, especially for these SMGs. So make sure that you are running the FTAC G5XO. Uh, so that you can play really aggressive with this thing. But I'll give you guys one last look at all the stats and the attachments that come with this original blueprint or with this specific class setup for the blueprint. Uh, if you guys have any questions about this specific class setup or the original blueprint itself, uh, make sure to leave them down in the comment section below and I'll be sure and try to help some of you guys out. I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and I'll see all you guys in the next.